Hi, my name is Paloma McGregor, and I'm the director of Angela's Pulse and the founder of Dancing While Black. So Dancing While Black is an initiative that I started in 2012 to bring the voices of black dance artists to the center of conversations around experimentation, around where dance happens, around equity in the field. Dancing While Black to me is so interesting because I think in New Orleans in particular that we have a very narrow viewpoint of what black dance is and could be and looks like and we have very few organizations I think that give us the depth and the breadth of what that work could look like. There are four choreographers who have come from outside of New Orleans who were selected through uh, the advice of an advi a local New Orleans advisory panel Junebug has really been working on the ground to help to shepherd how those efforts come to fruition. The advisory panel kind of put forward their ideal hopes, the things that they were most interested in working on in their communities. We curated these particular artists and then the work of figuring out, you know, when these workshops were going to happen, who they were going to happen with, who was the ideal artist to work with, what community um, became a, a big conversation. We don't like to think about these things alone. We always think about processes as collaborations and long-lasting relationships with people. So I always think about the exchange in three ways, that this full exchange is happening both by teaching, by learning, by witnessing. And that these three things happen every time we have an engagement here in New Orleans. For the artists who are coming in to really feel in their bones the what it's like to be making work, to be exchanging, to be practicing their artistic voices and visioning in a place where culturally they're not at the periphery um, is a huge gift. And the fact that these artists who are coming in span three generations of artistic practice, so having them be in exchange with one another is really significant. One thing that we're experimenting with is the idea of an incubator, an artist incubator space, where the artist gets to come in and to just with a seed of an idea, not a polished idea at all, but just a seed, and we're calling that under construction. And the idea being that it is rare for artists, and particularly black artists, to have space to just experiment. We need, as artists, to have space, generative space, uh, where people ask questions in a way that helps us ask questions of ourselves and of that work how we can deepen what we're doing um, and go further with that work. And I really just hope that the exchanges that happen will add another layer of meaning, of reflection, of seeing themselves in the work when, they, when the audiences witness the work on stage. And that I hope that for the artists who are showing work, that the idea of exchange that is so inherent to live performance has another layer of meaning and depth because these are audiences that they feel deeply connected to and who have actually helped to build the work that they're showing, have helped to deepen their own practice as artists, have helped to reflect back to them the significance of blackness in their work that doesn't always happen when one goes on tour to share one's work and it's a huge part of why the exchange beforehand is as important if not more important than the performance itself for me. Mm -hmm.